this is Sean and you are watching my pagan channel on YouTube. Um, this video is going to be about coming out of the proverbial broom closet about your religion to so the people that you care about. Um, this is just going to be a relatively short video. I'm sorry I haven't posted up a video in the past two weeks. I have been busy with work. Um, it's been crazy hectic. So. But this is just going to be a really quick video. Um, some tips on coming out to your family about your uh, religious path. Um, first thing I'm going to have to say is be discreet with who you tell. Make sure it's someone that you know that will not judge you. Make sure it's someone that you trust. Saying that this is a person that isn't going to go around um, saying, oh, this person is this and all that stuff. Um, you've got to be careful with who you tell, um, because in, I know that in some states in the U.S. people will actually be fired for jobs just for being suspected of being witches. And I don't know exactly which states, but it's something that I could look into and I can get back to you guys on. Um, you've got to be careful with how you word it. Um, if you aren't comfortable using the term, um, I'm pagan or I'm Wiccan or I'm a pra uh, witch practitioner, um, like I said with one of my previous videos on labels, you've got to be careful with how you label yourself because there are connotations uh, with what labels that you use to um, peg yourself as. Um, this kind of this next tip kind of is like two in one. Um, don't be defensive and don't go in guns blazing when you don't don't go right into a conversation and start saying that. Oh well. I'm looking and you need to know this, 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 and this, and then that causes the person that you're telling to put their bed up, and it just causes a whole mess of things, and a complete misunderstanding. So just don't be defensive about it, because paganism or Wicca does not have anything that needs to be defended, because it is not a religion that has anything negative about it. Um, you have to be confident in your explanation and uh, how you present your religion to the people that you are presenting it to. Um, it's probably best to know your craft, as in understand it more than what your current work knowledge is of it. If your working knowledge is already really good, like you've been studying it for a few years and everything, you've got a really good working knowledge, then that's fine. But if you're just only now coming into it and you want to label yourself as that, give it a while before you start going out saying that you're pagan and that you're Wiccan or that you're a witch practitioner because you need to be sure that one, the path is for you and two, if it is for you, you need to study it a bit before you go off into telling people that this is what I am uh, deal with it pretty much um, I really, the biggest thing that I have to tell you though is um, be prepared for any sort of backlash because, again, if you end up going in guns blazing, there is going to be backlash hitting you pretty hard by the people that you're telling if they aren't open minded or accepting of it. But um, just always be, hope for the best, be prepared for the worst. That's one of my favorite uh, phrases. Hope for the best, prepare for the worst. So just be prepared in case of they come at you in a defensive position if you go on defensive. Again, don't go on defensive with guns blazing. Just be calm about it and be respectful in how you talk to the person about it. That's something else that will prevent any sort of misunderstanding from occurring. Um, and really, you shouldn't feel like you have to share your religious beliefs with anyone unless you feel like you are ready to. Make sure that you you feel that you're ready to put yourself out there and your uh, religious beliefs out there. And make sure that who you're telling is someone that will be very open-minded about it. Um, someone that you can trust that will not judge you for, um, for your own religious beliefs. That's, uh, that's pretty much about it. Um, I know this is a short video kind of being lazy today, so if you just want to um, write a comment down asking me to expand on a certain topic or expand on my explanation, please do so. Send me a message uh, Send me a message through Facebook if you want to. Just um, 
again, this is just a really short video. I've been working really hard for the past week and a half, and it's just been crazy hours and all. And I'm kind of tired, and this is the first chance I've gotten to actually make a video. And this is like my shortest video that I've ever made. So I hope that I didn't disappoint you guys with the video. Um, again, it's just really short tips. Just recap on that. Don't go on guns blazing and being defensive about it. Be discreet with who you tell. Make sure it's a person you know that you can trust. Um, know your craft and be confident in your explanation of your religious beliefs. Be careful how you word it. Um, if you don't want to use uh, labels such as Wiccan and Pagan, then don't just say that this is my own personal belief, this is how I believe it, this is how I practice it. And don't share your religious beliefs unless you feel like you are ready to put it out there to the world. So, again, this is just a short video. Um, wherever you are, whether it be morning, noon, or night, I give you all many blessings and blessed week.